hello my beautiful soul welcome to my channel goddess of light 11 11 wow it's been a minute so let me pray to the you know i'm gonna pray that first and then i'm going to um have a little chit chat with you guys and then i will do you know a little bit of readings not much because there's it's I've been out for a while. It's been a long journey and we're gonna, you know, we have a lot to discuss. We have a lot of healings to do. We have a lot to prepare for. So I'm going to say, hold on to your seat. And, you know, like I say, we got a lot of work to do. So it's been a while. Um, it's probably like maybe eight or nine months since I've been out. So, yeah. Thank you, God. Thank you, universe. You know, Holy Spirit. Ancestors who are in the highest vibration. My guardian angels, my angels. All deities or entities that are helping me. You know, the ascended masters. Everyone that have been helping me. I want to say thank you. I am beyond grateful. I am beyond thankful to the Most High. I give Him all praise, always and forevermore. So let's get this reading done. Um, I've been guided for a while now to start doing this, but I wanted to do something for myself, you know, because this wasn't, this is not, um, I had to humble myself to let God use me however possible. And I know that I couldn't be on my pride, on my ego. You know, I had to let things flow however it is. You know, whatever that was going on, um, it's not my choice. You know, it wasn't my choice. They say if you are, you know, many are calling if you are chosen. I was chosen and still are chosen. And there's a lot of work that I had to do. And throughout this, y'all hang with me. Y'all will learn like different type of, you know, technique how to heal yourself because y'all gonna need it. Um, as a soul family, I am beyond grateful. I am beyond thankful. I don't care if it's one of you that I listen to the channel, because if one person listen to the channel, then they will tell another person what they hear. And then, you know, another, another. So I am good on that. This is for me. I am back embarking this journey, um, to make the world a better place usually i'm going very quickly so i am speaking from my heart i am being honest yes i've been in the dark night of the soul i had to learn a lot of lesson not because i owe any karmic debt um i do not owe any karmic debt on this lifetime i am good and i am hoping continue to the next for whatever that's coming next there was, you will learn a lot of things from me. You will learn what I know and what I'm, you know, whatever God allowed me to say, to help you guys moving forward will do. This is where I am, but I had to remove anyone who's gonna be, I'm going to say this with, you know, with kindness, with compassion, with empathy. I am a leader. I'm not here to babysit anyone. Um, if you are, I take this healing things very seriously. We're going to have fun. You all know me. I'm very lighthearted. Um, but if anyone that know me know I'm very lighthearted, I make everyone feel at ease. I make everyone feel at peace, whatever that that may be. So if you want to heal, you can, you may stay. If you want to come in and create drama telling me about God, I can telling you more thing about God, then you'll be shocked to your uh, seat. So 
You, nobody need to tell me, oh, you need to repent, Christian. You can keep all those religion things to yourself. It don't bother me. I had to heal from all of those too. So um, we're going to keep moving forward. But if you come into the channel, we're going to learn how to heal, leaving the past behind us, leaving present behind us, whatever that needs to go, until you can figure all that out. Yes, I am talking because I have not been, and I'm going to be talking until that I feel like you guys heard me, you know, and then do the reading. Because those readings, you know, um, I'm not talking about any other way I'm talking about me. This is just a tools. You see, keep community keep coming out. So, yes, I do live in a community. Yes, there's something that's going about community right now. That's need to be solved. That's need to be, you know, um, rebuked. But we're gonna we're gonna be fair. Um, as a leader, you're supposed to be fair. My needed. You're supposed to be firm. I stand firm in my ground. Nobody gonna throw negative energy on my readings. You're not gonna do things on that, on on my readers or my um, my collective. This is where we are and this is where we're gonna keep it. We're gonna keep it. Uh, we have message of concern um, from a mature woman. She could be a lawyer, she could be a judge, she could be, um, they look like this message is coming from her. Unexpected income also for somebody. And also somebody might be somebody might be paying a lovers because this is flip this is come out. So someone is might be either bribing or paying a lovers um for whatever for something for something here. So these messages just randomly pop out of my head. So and then the cards flip out. So I'm just whatever that's going, you know, we're gonna go with the flow. Like I said, I'm not here to babysit anybody. So any, I'm gonna open the comments. Um, you're not going to sending negative energy or negative things. You know, try to slow anybody stuff. Anyone that do that, you will be black. You will be black, and message will be deleted. So this is where we are. We're gonna um, we're gonna do things the right way. I cannot stop anybody from watching me. Uh, from listening to me but you know we know where we are in this world right now so um, there's going to be you know a lot of shocking revelation a lot of tower movement that's going to happen um, as we're moving forward so expect the unexpected so again seven minutes just you know letting you know where I am in my journey I have been doing a lot, a lot of work. Let's see what's the universe, Holy Spirit, my God. The universe. Essences who are in the hybrid high vibration. What do you have for my spirit guide? What do you have for my collective? What do you have for my collective? Oh, we have official person. Someone is about to ex expect some type of messages from support some type of, of official person this person could be in the military but whatever message this person has they might be a little bit hesitant to come forward this person is older 22 but this is a message of balance. This is someone that know they have to bring something forward. They have to bring something to, um, they have to bring some type of message that's going to bring um, balance. And this person know they have to bring, again, I'm getting like, they have to bring some type of message. They have to come forward. They have to be honest and truthful. Um, for it to bring some type of balance because this is someone this is this person has some type of high ranking and you know official person whomever you are someone this is someone that have some type of high ranking but they know they have to bring honest they have to be honest and truthful about some type of situation that's what I'm getting because they are in the upright so this is someone that's supposed to bring fairness that's supposed to bring balance you know this this person could have been in the military for a very long time they spent all their lives pretty much in the military 
and you know that's what i'm getting you but they they have to bring balance what else do you have for me i need two more two more spirit guide yeah pathway so you know you guys could be you know you guys and you're doing the right things whatever pathway you choose this is beautiful transformation here this person need to let things be the way it's supposed to be um with the official person here they have to let they have to let someone here you can see all the butterfly here this is about transformation this is someone solar plexus chakra is this they are going in the path pathway this official person he need to bring balance into this whomever this is that's going into the pathway everybody need to choose a path here that's why with number 35 someone could be between 35 between 22 and 35 and someone also could be also 57 years old someone could be also 57 here see yeah we have metro mail at the bottom and we also have in despair we have occupation someone in here is you know doing what they're supposed to do this is someone that walk alone you can see this person you know i you know people designing things but they walk alone this is someone that walk alone this is what they do that's what i'm getting here but someone is in, you know, this person is in the thought. There's someone that is in the thought. Like I say, there's going to be a lot of tower moment. Someone is my is going to be having some type of tower moment here. Give me one more. Hold, uh, Holy Spirit, Spirit God, give me one more, please. Thank you. So I asked for one, so I got two. We'll take both. Yep. Judic judication and a house. So... There was something about a house. There's some type of courthouse that's going on. We're getting some type of house. And this official person here, they need to make the right thing. They need to they need to call, you know, they need to call the truth. They need to make some type of uh the right decision here about a house. That's what I'm getting. But there's something that's going on in the courthouse. And the judge is is thinking some there's might be something that's going to require a new judge also for some type of judication for something to make uh, to be fair and right and just because it's also here someone might be going through some type of divorce and they are trying to figure out who's having a house there's you know and they are trying to make some type of decision but whatever decision is in here is the right things because 20 is judgment it's gonna be you know there's gonna be just things is gonna be just because i feel like the universe is also is gonna make um someone in here to tell the truth to be honest and truthful about this situation okay that's what i'm getting because there's judgment that's calling on some type of house Yep, see, great fortune is at the bottom, number 26, and we have family room. Something is going to make right for a family. Someone is might be receiving a gift or someone is getting some type of gift here. But there was a false person. Like I said, someone is working with two lovers. Someone might be working with, you know, two lovers here. Um, what's, wow, look at that. There's also, there's something that's, there's a courthouse thing that is over. There's something in here that's happening because this wasn't a reverse. There's something here in the courthouse that is in the reverse. The courthouse is in the reverse telling me that there's some type of courthouse that is over. Okay. So if any of you, you know, still lingering around thinking like, you know, there's something in the court that's still going on, it's over, it's done. But there's someone that might be going to divorce here. They expect to get some type of house. You know, there's there's a couple of story here. There's an official person that need to, to be just fair in bringing something here um, about a pathway for someone, you know, for someone here, because number 35, it's eight, prosperity, abundance, you know, they need to let, this is about a, mess, a messenger. This is, you know, 
with the butterfly here transformation change they need to let this happen because that's what this person here someone here is supposed to learn some type of lesson also it is about you know this is someone that have a past life pathway they're supposed to do whether you think you are you know you you know um you are have some type of high ranking whatever that is you're supposed to let it happen um because that's it is like something from the past like past life that's supposed to happen and no one can stop it because it's only ordained by the by god holy spirit spirit guy what do you have for my beautiful collective so we have friendship so i understand that a friend in my life is for a reason so for some of you you might have some new friends you know, you might have making some new friends. Someone might want to be your friends. There's some type of friendship that's coming for you guys. You know, friendship and alliances. That's what I'm getting that's coming for uh, for you guys. Holy Spirit. Spirit God, what else do you have for my beautiful collective? And we have acceptance. So you need to accept it, your gifts. You need to accept it, who you are. You know, um, you can try to go around it. I am learning to accept the things that I cannot change. Yeah, you know, go with the flow. That's what I, you know, that's what I'm saying. Accept yourself, accept, you know, accept things, accept people for who they are. You cannot try to change, um, you know, people. You know, you can only elevate it yourself, elevate it people around you. You may not try to change anyone. That's what, you know, that's what's going on in this new world right now. So we cannot try to happen in people's lives and things like we not we want to change who they are or the perspective or you know whatever you know if someone you know you Muslim you know I'm Christian or I'm spiritual you cannot try to change people's views or perspective of you because everyone have free wills. This is where we are in this pathway. This is what that's that's what I'm saying. This official person he have to let something have to let someone be in the pathway because this is like it's like a contract with God. This is something that's been ordained before this person come to this earth, whether it is the official person or someone else. We're gonna keep on moving. It's it's all here. Like I say, I've been going to the work I've been doing the work and I've been going through it for a reason. So again, we have to accept whomever. You see, we have grief. I understand that losing something is an opportunity to appreciate it. You know, for a lot of people, the only way you know what you you know what what you had is when you lose it. Someone might be going through some type of painful grief right now. And I'm getting I'm getting this someone is might be either losing a loved one or a relationship but you know this person might have not appreciate the love they have before until you know they lose that person yeah because someone could have been indecisive someone could have been had you know um choices between two people between three people how many people but until they lose that person that's when they realize that and if someone hasn't go through that they're gonna go through that and they're gonna go to all the different stages of understand you know they're gonna have the understanding that wow i lose the best thing that ever happened in my life you know like it's not about you being whole or not complete when you ask God to send you someone that you ask God to send, you know, whether it is, you know, friend, families, you know, co-worker, jobs, or, you know, whatever it is and stuff like that, is there for a reason. This person coming into your life, you know, you're supposed to nurture in each other. I'm not going to say that you do everything for them and they don't do nothing for you. That's become an unbalance. That's become a one-sided. That's just like, okay, I love you, but you don't love me. And, you know, this person love you, you don't love them. And things like that, things become because people have choices. So if you're going to, you know, I feel like this is going to be very hard for someone because they're going to be like, wow, you know, this person was probably like the most amazing, you know, man, the most amazing woman that I have ever met. And I lose her, I lose him because, you know, my insecurity, my pride, my ego, because 
I, you know, instead of humble myself and listen to God, and they didn't. That's what I'm getting here. So, you know, be mindful of, you know, of people that, you know, when you ask God for something, he said it to you and stuff, you know, use your discernment. We got a lot of lesson to learn, people. We got a lot to learn. Holy Spirit, Spirit God, what I see you have my beautiful collective. We have that, you know. I release the need to know all the answers. You know, for a lot of us and stuff, it's just that we we doubted people. You know, I was in the shower. I, you know, that came in into my mind that I'd get that message about doubt. You know, how you, someone pop up into your life, you doubted the person, right? And the reason why, you know, in it's not just even about you doubt it yourself instead of you like well if you know how they say trust no one that that's when you started doubting everything including god including yourself and then you start making a lot of mistakes because you doubted yourself because you want to know everything instead of go with the flow you know and you know there was there was people there was people that is very patient, good or bad. I'm going to say there is people that is very patient. They're going to be patient. They're going to show you everything and anything, you know, just so you can believe them until they get what you want. So that's why we use wisdom to get the knowledge we need from God. We ask God before you sitting there, ask God for a million dollars. Ask God for a wisdom. Ask God for wisdom of discernment. How you can move forward. How you can use your discernment. Because you know, you can have you can have wisdom, but if you don't have no understanding and stuff, this is just like the same. You know, it's just like you're gonna go on a circle because it's gonna bring fear. It's gonna bring doubt to yourself. To whatever that's going on, whether it's a relationship, whether it's job, whether it's people, whatever this is, I felt like, you know, because we want to know everything. And that's, you know, and that's something that I had, I had to learn on my journey because I wanted to know everything. And, you know, I've been nudging by my spirit guy, by God, you know, but the universe is like, you can trust us. It's okay. You can do this. It doesn't matter what anyone do or say, you know, we got you. We got you. But I'm like, I'm not, I need to know more. I need to know what's going on, you know, and that's called for, you know, self doubt because not because that, you know, you're going to have, like I said, <laughs> see, perseverance. I saw these cards. They, for me, that, you know, I get this card was message for me. You know, I, I think that I'm, I'm just going to telling you that, like I say, I'm a teacher. I'm a leader. I don't have time to sit in there and try to negotiate with myself. I will give that I'll be the first one to tell myself, listen, honey, you need to get out of that energy because if it's not yours, get out of it. So perseverance. I know that I can, you know, I can do whatever I set my mind to. Absolutely. So with anyone, you know, you can do the work. You can do it. You just have to put your minds, you know, because some of us afraid afraid of failure. Yes, you know, some of us afraid of failure. But why are you manifesting these things into your life? Because whatever you you fear, it's become your enemy. Okay? Your whatever you fear become your enemy. So I have to remind now you're gonna learn as you as we started doing this, you're gonna learn a lot. But I'm saying that you know, every doubt, every fears become your enemies, okay. I understand that a mistake is only an opportunity to learn. Absolutely. It's a lesson. So don't make, don't make, you know, your fears become your enemies. I love this. So you can see these cards. Like I get the message so quick, so quick in these cards, you know, and, you know, and for me, I'm like, I'm like one of those people. I want to know more. I told you guys. This is something about me. I, you know, I'm like one of those. 
I want to know. I, <laughs> I want to know. And I'm honest about that because uh, that way that you guys can learn from my mistake. You know, when we say we let go and let God, meant it. Let go and let God. So we have Ten of Wands, King of Swords. So right now, this King of King of Swords is my having you know a lot of burden because some of you, some of you might be also have a lot of protection around you. You with the Ten of Wands being here, so the Ten of um the King of Swords might be burdened a little bit. Whomever he is. Yeah, some type of working together. Yeah, eight of pentacles. Because for some of you, you actually mastered yourself. That's what I'm getting here also. Yeah, seven of swords. Look at that. Seven of swords, four of swords, nine of swords. Good Lord, two of pentacles. Lots of swords, lots of mental conflicts. You know, because someone in here wants, someone in here wants to get, you know, want. it's like someone in here wants to put someone down all together like i want you to be down and stay down that's what i'm getting here but you know god say uh-uh not today so that's what i say you guys might have a lot of protection around you with the ten of wands here and whomever this king of swords here he's um not very happy five of swords again five of swords someone here might want you know you have to self-sabotage yourself. We have Queen of Pentacles here that wants you to self-sabotage yourself, whomever she is. We have Page of Cups here. But someone here know they owe you an apology. Yeah, King of Wands. Everybody's burdened. King of Wands is sitting here looking like a lot of mercy. Here is Leo Sagittarius. We have the moon because someone in here wants to create confusion for you. They um they might be they create confusion. Yeah. We have the wall. But I felt like there's some of you about to be highly celebrated because you're getting some type of justice. Some of you are about to end a cycle. Not only you end a cycle, but you're going to be celebrated around the world. That's what I'm getting here with Justice, Three of Cups, the, um, the wall here. There's going to be some type of highs because some of you get some type of justice. Karmic justice to be specific. Um, one thing people doesn't, uh, justice is number 11. 11 is a master number also. King of Swords here. And they, this King of Swords is highly pissed off because they are watching you, getting some type of justice, Queen of Cups. They were working together with this Empress and the Devil. The Empress here might be the Devil. But the Angel is bringing, is bringing balance, as you can see, Six of Swords. The Angel is keeping things balanced here. And this king of king of swords, whatever Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, they are not happy. So we have Ace of Cups in the reverse. Ace of Cups in the reverse. Love it one. Could be your ancestors. It could be your family also. They are sideways. So you have some wishy, <laughs> wishy-washy family member. That's what I'm getting with the Ace of Cups sideways here. Nine of Wands. They, I feel like for some of you, your family, some some of you family wants you to be in the wounded warrior. They want you to be, they wanted you to stay in the wounded warrior. They want you to be like, uh, be so broken for whatever reason. Yeah. 
Yeah, because someone doesn't want you to get to the two of cups. And the two of cups is does it the two of cups is not is for some of you it's a contract with the universe because you can see the line gets I feel like for some of you the line gets when um Leo season the line gets open. You guys got some type of contract with the universe and that's could have either happened um two years ago when the lines gets open you guys got your contract with the universe because you guys complete a cycle you guys complete a karmic cycle that's what i'm getting here and some of you ace of cups here i'm just going to keep it simple i'm going to say love it one doesn't want you to get there they don't want for some of you this is you trying to aligning with yourself and you have people you have um you know you have people try to standing in your way but with also with the knight of wands here they are also black from you they are black from your two cups so what that means uh is that wherever you are going with your contract with god with the universe your family your loved one might not be able to go with you because with the nine of ones here you know because you also are protected from them you are protected from them they are protected from you what um, however this is but this contract here this is i'm not feeling like this is a relationship i'm getting this is a contract with the universe and for some of you this is you um aligning with you know the masculine and the feminine so you are good where you are going whether it's with the universe whether it's a relationship a job a partnership you are good but there is your loving you know, one i wish you were actually so you know i'm just i'm gonna keep it you know um with compassion I'm gonna keep it with compassion. Uh, universe, what I see you have, Mr. Universe. Okay, oh, Universe, Holy Spirit. You know, see, that's what I'm saying. Some of you are co creating with God, with the universe. I'm being truthful. Yeah, Nine of Pentacles. You guys are self-sufficient and i felt like if you guys are worried there's no need for you guys to be worried at all at all you are going to be self-sufficient independent i'm trying to put these cards here so you can do as we go i will change the way that i do readings like i said this is just a tools so take what resonate and leave the rest so with the knight of pentacles here you guys are going to be, regardless what, the, you see what's come after the two of cups, right? Like I said, this is not a contract with, you know, a relationship. This is a contract with the universe that's going to bring you abundance. You're going to be, you might actually stay single um, by you staying single, by you being celibacy. You're going to be um, very abundant, very blessed and stuff. And I see a lot of things. I see a lot of celebration, you know, I'm seeing, you know, people are joyful, people are happy. So there's a lot going on right now. So I'm just going to keep it simple. I'm just going to keep it simple. But some of you are going to be self-sufficient, self-sufficient, independent, and very abundant uh, by, you know, because of uh, whatever that you embark it with the universe. Five of Swords. But someone want to sabotage this for you guys. Five of Swords. Whew. Oh. You know what? Justice. If it's not the legal system that is trying to sabotage you, it's a Libra. I'm just going to be truthful and honest. There's a Libra. If it's not a Libra that is trying to sabotage you, it's the justice system. But I don't think they can because it's, you know, someone want to, someone want to um, do some injustice to you, but I don't think they can because I feel like if they do that, because I'm going to say this, this is something that I learned throughout my, you know, being in that moment of the soul. Justice is justice. 
and if a libra is trying to do injustice to someone by doing the wrong thing they also will go through hard karma that's just how it is because justice here justice up there doesn't change because if you're doing some if you're doing injustice to someone that is also that justice in their chart that they're supposed to bring something in uh they're supposed to bring justice to someone or something you try to sabotage it or you try because that's what i'm getting here someone is trying to sabotage someone here to try to be unjust to be fair but you can see this is not in the reverse it's coming sideways someone is having a hard time doing it because it's wrong you can't you cannot try to you know try to sabotage someone by doing injustice to them it's wrong in so many level and we're gonna keep on moving but that's what i'm getting here someone is trying whether it's whether it's is in the justice system or whether it is in you know whether it's the libra that is doing this someone is playing my game they are you know they try to they're playing my game you know they want someone to feel sad here they want someone to feel you know like things is fogging around the, you know them and stuff like that you know but the only thing is that at the end whomever that done that they the one who's gonna be sad because you can see these two people right there someone he could be doing this to two people you can see those those two people like you know what I'm done. I'm walking away from you. And this person here, they still carry three swords, which is they had will come back on them. So that's what I'm going to say. If anyone is trying to do any type of injustice to someone here, you know, however this is going to be, karma is going to serve regardless. Regardless. And they, whomever that is trying to cause the injustice, they it will you know there will be the one that deal with what it is in this earth or uh you know and they will you know five b yeah see i remember i saw the lovers i say someone is paying a lovers so this person you know this person could be a twins if they are not a twin this is the lovers and this card also come out the queen of wands it was leo sagittarius so this person could be you know they could be in a relationship together with someone here but i'm feeling here whomever this is whomever this is this is a lovers um these two people could be in a relationship that try to do and that's try to do some type of injustice with someone but like i said what else we have temperance yeah angel of balance it could be a sagittarius there's someone who could be a sagittarius doesn't have to be but i feel like things is going to be balanced i keep saying that things is going to be balanced someone here need to be patient but things is going to be balanced out we have three of ones someone need to someone is going to have to walk away from the past you know, I feel like someone in here is waiting for their ship to arrive, but someone is going to have to walk away from this, from this. Like, you can try. You know, people are very consistent and persistent and try to destroy other people's lives, right? But what they don't understand, you're destroying your lineage. That's what you're doing. You're creating karma for your own lineage, whether that, you know, good or bad. Because right now, we all everybody you know god say it's time and with what you know with what's going on right now things is going to start moving fast you're not gonna wait you know to see you know like that's what i told people don't wait to see karma happen to anybody you don't wait to see you know don't wish any negative things some people don't wish any ill intent on people don't have no evil eyes on people and stuff like that give it to god and let god deal with it you know whatever that you got going on just going about your business and stuff but i feel like someone here the angels is guided somebody here to walk away from someone or something that is not serving their highest good but someone in here might be very focused on you know try to um 
yeah try to either harm someone you know because that's what i'm getting here try to create injustice for someone when they know that's not or whomever the lover is here um in this queen of wands but the angel is telling this person that walk away from the past keep it moving because for some of you and for somebody here somebody is an earth angels also we have here with the temperance holy spirit spirit down what else do you have for my beautiful collective yeah we have the king of cups So, whomever this King of Cups, they have some type of missed opportunities. This person, they felt like they have some type of miss missed opportunity, but they feel up. They they are a little bit optimistic that they can get. They they still hopeful. That's what I'm getting here. Whatever whomever this King of Cups here, they hopeful. They expect something to happen here. Give me one more card, please. Yeah, Nine of Swords. Yeah, they're hopeful, but they're having a lot of sleepless night. They're having a lot of... They might be very stressed. Someone in here having a lot of stress, a lot of anxiety, because they expect something here to happen. They want something to happen. They are stressful. They, they're having a lot of sleepless night, but they because they Four of Cups here, it's not completely upright. So this is someone that is hopeful, but they're really stressed i don't know whatever this person done it stressed them out yeah four of swords but they know that they need to put something to us someone in here could have lies i feel like with the four of swords here someone could have lied oh whatever this person did It get them in hot water. Someone in here could have get paid working together. They did something here for money. They're working. So we have the hierophant here. If it's someone could have either get paid, get married, uh, be in an institution, get into a contract here because of money, working together. We have four of swords, seven of swords, eight of pentacles, ace of pentacles. Someone here did something for money with an institution here. You can see, look at that two of wands. Someone could have traveled to go do something because they was expecting to get some type of money here. And the queen of swords cut them off because the queen of swords get some type of enlightenment and cut them off. Mm -hmm. And now they are black from, uh, they are black. So I'm um, whatever this person did, it get them in hot water. Now they stress, they worried with the higher fan. They're getting married, get some type of institution or contract or a group here. You can see there's two people in here that's under judgment. And also what I'm getting here, judgment uh, with the higher fan here is that someone is under judgment. You can see this uh, God is calling judgment on somebody here for whatever, um, whatever they cause. Ace of Cups. Look at that. Justice, King of Swords. We have Justice and King of Swords. So some of you are getting Justice. And I felt like, yeah, for some of you, this King of Swords here, we have Archangel. Some, there is an angel here that is calling. You guys have a lot of, there's a lot of protection around you guys. But there's some type of justice that's going to be done here. Things is going to be fair and balanced for your family. Because, you know, with, just, with justice here, with the King of Swords, like I say, there's some type of, you know, loved one here. 
so if you guys expected you're gonna get justice for your um for your loved one so there's no need to worry okay and like and your loved one could be also working with this king of swords this person could be in you know some you know whatever they are they could be a lawyer they could be a judge there could be something your loved one could be working with them but you're still gonna get justice so because we have justice here and sideways we have justice sideways here go for the nine of swords please yeah this person black from you we have knight of we have nine of wands and we have knight of wands this is someone that is you know very passionate i'm getting you know this is someone that is very passionate so you do it for this person i'm gonna keep it simple you do it for this person so this this is what you know someone could have you know very passionate about you and you can see you can see this person male or female you know we have a lot of justice here we we have a lot of air here we have gemini we have cancer pisces scorpio aries leo sagittarius here we have a lot of a lot of water and a lot of air here a lot of fire also not not a lot of earth but what i'm getting here this is someone that is very passionate about you you do it for this person whether it's male or female and you know and they this person holding the one and stuff like that they want you this person this, i feel like this is what driving this person you know this okay this is someone that is very really attracted to you in a sexual way clarify okay, the king of cups we have the emperor so the whomever they this king of cups here they they are try they are trying they are trying to let go of some type of conflicts because this person still desire you. Clarify the Queen of Wands, please. Yeah, like I say again, the angel is guided the Queen of Wands to leave, to move, to leave, to do something here, to put an end into creating burdens. This person is trying. They're trying, but you know, I felt like you know, with this story that's being told, is that they are trying because ten of one is sideways. If it was, you know, this way, I will say this person is stuck. But they are trying to move on. They are trying to move forward here. So you guys are just gonna have to be patient. Clarify the King of Swords that's been coming out. Clarify the King of Swords. Yeah, um, there's something. Like the King of Swords might be creating some type of stalemate or there's something they do not see. Yeah, heartbreak through your swords. The, the King of Swords is trying to either create a heartbreak or they do not see a heartbreak. What is the Three of Swords, please? Yeah, they do not see something, you know, a heartbreak when it's come to the um, Queen of Pentacles that is sideways. This person doesn't see that. They, you know, because I feel like there is a uh, Queen of Pentacles here that is, you know, she's repairing, she's trying to repairing, you know, and I feel like the King of Swords doesn't care. That's the, that's what I'm getting here. With the Queen of Pentacles sideways, this person doesn't see that they, you know, they don't care. Whomever the King of Swords is, and it's sad because... I feel like this person is choosing this person, love it one to work with them, to creating something that someone is trying to repair. Because you can see, this is someone that their heart, you know, is ripped apart. And the the uh, Queen of Pentacles is sideways also. Wow, this is a lot. Can I find justice sideways? Yeah, three of wands. This is someone that does not want someone to be happy. Whomever this is, whatever says, is it a Libra or someone in the justice system? Someone doesn't want someone to be happy here. 
they are trying to create for someone to be stuck but i feel like you know god is saying uh-uh not today i'm not going to show you what i'm going to do the universe is like i'm not going to show you what i'm but justice will serve whether you like it or not that's what i'm getting here because the sun is in the reverse someone is get clarity here about the king of cups yeah there's a tower i say that before i even do the readings you know there's the tower moment someone is going to be shocked whenever the king of cups sees they're going to be shocked you know we have this son here could be a leo someone in here could be dealing with a leo also king of pentacles the king of pentacles is watching someone move forwards they might not be happy about it Someone in here is trying for something to go very slow. That's what I'm getting here. Clarified lovers, please. Wow. So, they, they, someone in here going through some type of divorce because their husband, someone husband or someone have some type of if anyone have any miscarriage i'm sorry if anyone lost you know yeah because we have the lovers here it could be also two females doesn't you know doesn't matter but i'm getting the ace of cups here someone could fake also someone could fake a pregnancy here just to keep someone Whatever this pregnancy here is either unexpected, so it could be a wife that is pregnant. It doesn't have to be a wife because the empress could be single, but I feel like someone in here with the ace of cups, this could be an unexpected pregnancy here. Someone the lovers might be lying about. way to a lover's God, look at the king of wands so yeah we have the magician here oh lord have mercy let's let us like walk away from this shall we we have the magician and we have the death card i feel like a magician here is wanting something ending to someone someone here is doing magic someone here could be doing water magic water magic here to end something for someone but by them doing that somebody end up having a victory oh tricks are for kids i'm hearing so someone in here could have been doing some type of magic here to especially they're doing water magic so so whatever this person is doing it's end up bringing an ending someone is gonna be having a um to hold someone back you know to create illusions you know this person could have been holding back from illusion end up and they end up getting some type of um they get their wish with the ten of pentacles because someone in his sweet kind generous loving they are listening to their intuition and they balance things out on their own because They're using whatever that magic to their advantage and bring a tower. Mm. Listen, I'm going to leave it right there. I love you guys so much. May you have a beautiful, may you have a beautiful day. Someone is in the Five of Pentacles, Nine of Swords. Someone is, someone in here feeling some type of luck. And they are about to be running to someone in here is in a hurry to create confusion knight of cups wanna or quickly wanna offer something to someone like i'm feeling like moving forward there is somebody who is about to be in a rush to do something it's end up closing a cycle out mm -hmm. they end up closing a cycle out
Yeah, create confusion, illusion, nine of cups here. You know, someone could have been like, oh, I'm going to go sleep. This could be happening in the past also. It's either, you know, we're going to say past, present, and future. Someone here could be trying and hurry to do. The only thing they're going to do is that closing a cycle out. Because we have the wheel of fortune here. Because someone is in the life purpose. They are in hermitess. Yeah. I say that already. Same cards come out. Someone here is about to be highly celebrated. All right, guys. You guys have a blessed day. So, bye. Yeah. Yeah. Because I've been guided to keep it there, to let it go right there. Until next time. Have a blessed day, guys. I love you.